All right, chat GPT, lots yes. of people using it. Uh, apparently, it's only 50% of the time right when it comes to a medical diagnosis. And this is one place that I find to be really special and important. I care about the diagnosis as an emergency physician. So in this study, they found that chat GPT did well half the amount of time. Now, comparing up to doctors, I think that ChatGPT did worse. I will say that. <laughs> there is no official study to say the accuracy in our diagnosis. But one thing that I think is interesting is that they also use ChatGPT to answer our board exams. You know, there are multiple board exams that we take through medical school, and ChatGPT passed all three of them. So I think that there are other modalities that ChatGPT can be used in, may not necessarily be in the official diagnosis, but possibly in other ways. For example, understanding risk profiles for individual patients so that you can then develop a personalized care plan. ChatGBT and AI can be used in the hospital just to identify patients who are more at risk than others. I think that there's so much opportunity there. ChatGBT could never pass that oral board exam, exactly. by the way, that Thank you have you. to do. You know what? You listen to me. I so. do listen to you. <laughs> Doctors are. Yeah, I appreciate that. A part of our board exams is an oral exam where you have to communicate <laughs> as what we'll learn about today. And my larger point is that <laughs> ChatGPT can be a tool, but not a replacement. Exactly. For a let's just, let's keep, yes, let's keep that motive going, because otherwise I would hate for uh, something to take my job. But I think that there's other opportunities where it can be used to bolster medicine, improve medicine, and make it better. And, and we are seeing AI used in hospitals even now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And there's also, a, uh, oh, I would say, a, a blossoming field of emergency medicine, clinical medicine, and use of artificial intelligence. Physicians are training in it to be, be able to better use it. I think it's going to be a, a, a good asset in the future as long as we figure out how to hone it in. Doctors better than 50%, though. Yes. yes. <laughs> yes. We are. We are. <laughs>